Hey everyone. So this isn't really a uh, scrapping video, just uh, something that was really annoying me and I couldn't find any information on. So I got this Buzz Quiz TV uh, uh, game for the PlayStation 3 and it was extremely difficult to figure out how to connect all of these because you have to sync the controllers to the dongle that's currently in the PS3 and I have to say it took me about 30 to 40 minutes to figure it out I think I got it that's why I'm making this video because I looked on YouTube and no one actually shows the process of connecting and making everything work with the game they just show everything already connected so I'll go through a quick step by step so what I found out is right now the dongles in uh, there's a button on the dongle but you before you press that you have to turn these guys on one by one or if you're playing alone turn one on but uh, if you're three two four players you have to turn as many as you're playing so I'm gonna turn all four of them on and show you how so there's a button here on the side so you have to have a steady blue light here so see this slow flashing light if you get a slow flashing light it's not the light you need you have to hold it again see the flashing solid blue so you have to wait until it flashes quickly I think about eight times and then you hold the power button until it turns blue. So we're doing the next one. So slow flashing is no good. You get the five the fast flashing about eight times, solid blue. Put it down. Again. Slow flashing. Hold the power button until it's solid blue. Again. Slow flashing. Hold the power button, and there you go. One, two, three, four. So now, on the dongle itself, so we have the dongle here. There is a button on the right, so you hold it until it starts flashing. And once it starts flashing, all the controllers are connected and see if you can see you press the button and the blue light turns on the game starts and you're good to go hopefully this saves some many hours of trial and error <laughs> took me at least 40 minutes to figure out that process because I didn't have uh, the instruction for it so everything works I'll even show you see that they're all flashing all four synced and working properly uh, let's play with friends there you go and you can see in the on the TV that every time there's something happens all four controllers flash Pick the guy, there you go. Next one, there you go. Perfect. There you go. There you go. So, like you can see, all of them are working, and it's wonderful. So, pretty much what you have to do, like I said, so like I said, pretty much what you have to do is put the game in, wait until you get that screen where it says press the buzzer or the yellow button for online play, then you turn them on, you wait for the quick flashing uh, blue light 
and you wait and you hold the power button, it becomes solid blue. If you get the slow flashing light that you usually do at the, at the on the first try, retry again, hold the power button, you'll get the quick flash, hold that power button until you get a solid blue light. Put all the controllers that you're planning to use in that solid blue light state. So if you're one player, do it for one, two for two, three for three, four for four. And then press the bind button on the USB dongle until you get the blue flashing light. Once the blue flashing light turns on, all the dongles automatically get connected to it and then you can play. Hopefully this saves a lot of people a lot of trouble. Thanks.